What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel. I'm Steven. This is Steven and Stereo. Today, diving back into more Dreamcatcher. We have a fairly new release from them. The song is called Vision. Uh, it's the official music video, so we're just gonna dive in. You guys know I've been checking out Dreamcatcher. I fucking love this group. I think they're so cool. So I'm looking forward to this. Let's do it. Those harmonies right there, like you gotta listen to that section. Ready for it? Oh my god, so good. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> okay, so what I see from the lyrics here, before I even say that, what the fuck is that chorus? So good, so strong. I love this group because I feel like the chorus is always like, you get this huge buildup up until that chorus drop and then it's just like, all bets are off. Best best group ever. What I love about the lyrics here, at least from what I'm getting out of it, is this idea of, look, we're out here. We are, like, letting all of our passion and dreams be dried up. We're out here like a desert. Like, we, we don't have... Like, we're allowing ourselves to be sort of left in this area just to rot, just to let everything go to waste. But like we have this unquenchable thirst or this desire for more, right? And the only way to be able to break out of that moment is to take the hard path. Like we're going to have to go towards battle. We can't escape it because the only way to get the things that you want in life, you have to be willing to stand up for it, to plant your flag and to fight for it. Again, another reason I love this group. They're so inspirational. But this is sort of that forward march anthem of like, hey, I'm going to give you the vision of what's real and we are going to march our way through that. We're going to have hope and we're going to see this this dream, but then we're going to see it through as we march through this and incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-oh. Turning over pay, turning over pay, turning over pay. So I'm shake, check your guy, you don't can't do them down. I'm your gym, big gym, big pain, deep gray. Charge a life, take a chance, kick, lay, shake, lay. Gotta hunt you, gotta hunt you, karma. Gotta get you, gotta get you, karma. Woo! I'm gonna kill, I'm gonna let me down myself. Could I kill, could I kill? You need in this hole. Yeah, for me. And I got the boon. Fuck, yes. Fuck, yes. Yes! Yes! 
Peace. Yes, I fucking love this group so much. So many of the things that they do, not just from a musical standpoint, though, are obviously like I'm a huge fan of where they draw influences to make these instrumentals. I think that I think that what they've done by taking like elements of new metal and metal and punk and all of these things that we've heard throughout their music, it's it's really beautiful and it lays a foundation, but it also adds a layer of knowing that when you're utilizing a lot of those instrumentals and stuff, you want to have sort of the lyricism that you would expect within some of those scenes. And one thing, if you're taking it from hardcore and punk, is this idea of fighting for what you believe in, standing up for what you believe in, even if it means that you stand alone, not dying on your knees, you were going to like essentially like metaphor, metaphor for war, but you're essentially going to go to war for your beliefs and to fight for the people that either can't fight for themselves or for the things like the animals, the earth, all of these things that don't necessarily have the same voice in a fight that um, we do. And so I love the idea that there's so much of a of an anthem here, so much of a motivational anthem to stand up and say, hey, plant your flag, know what you stand for, because a man that stands for nothing will fall for anything. Stand your ground on what you believe in and march forth, even if that march is through the hardest of times, whether it be this war or through these groups or whether it be through the tough storms ahead, just know that it's the other side of it that is the difference between losing and winning. And you just have to get forward because if you stand up for anything, if you care about anything, let it be something that you care about strong enough that you're willing to fight for it and you're willing to put it all on the line. And I love the Dreamcatcher just like invokes that spirit It invokes this idea of getting out there and owning life the way you want to. Um, I love this group for that. I love the fact that they have done such an incredible job with just this alternative soundscape. And it's such a beautiful thing to hear. I'm so glad that they have such a loyal fan base. By the way, any of the fans that I've had the opportunity to speak with or have little communication with has been incredible. And I'm so glad that like, we all sort of come together in this love for the style that they are doing here. So it's really fucking awesome. I really hope you guys enjoyed Vision. I feel like um, I'm always going to be looking forward to more Dreamcatcher because I'm obsessed. If you can't hear it in my voice, I'm sincerely obsessed with this group and I think they're fucking amazing. So I'm going to leave a link to this in the description. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Let me know in the comments how you're feeling. I'm going to leave a link to it. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.